this is my welcoming video so I'm just gonna answer questions that you guys have asked me I asked on my snapchat and my Instagram what questions I should answer and a couple people asked me questions so I'm gonna be answering them so I'm gonna start off by saying like my full name is Braylon McCall I'm 18 years old and somebody asked me my height I'm 5'5 I attend Florida Atlantic University I am currently academically I'm a junior but it's my first time at a university so I'm a freshman I dual enrolled when I was in high school and I got my AA before I graduated high school so that's why I'm technically a junior I also cheer for Florida Atlantic University we cheer for football and male and female basketball before I came to Florida Atlantic University I was living in a small town called Palm Coast and it's really small and no one ever leaves there but it's right in the middle of Daytona Beach Florida and St. Augustine Florida it did have some good things about it and that's where I lived and it was very convenient because everything was so close we were right in the middle of everything it was only like 30 to 45 minutes to get to St. Augustine same thing with Daytona and then I also cheered at my all-star gym in Daytona I was always in Daytona I forgot what else I was gonna say I attended Flagler Palm Coast High School where I lived there's two high schools one being FPC and then one being MHS which is Matanzas High School, and that's like our rivals or whatever. But yeah, three things I love. Oh, I'm looking over here because the questions are on my laptop. Yeah. Three things I love is music. I listen to music day and night. I don't know what my life would be like without music, so definitely love music. I obviously love cheer and food and sleep how many tattoos do you have and do you want more also do you have any piercings okay so i have a total of six tattoos i am planning on getting another one um on my thigh a bigger one and all my tattoos have meanings maybe i can make a video about like all my tattoos and their meanings and maybe I'll vlog the next tattoo that I get because it's a bigger one and I'm very excited about it I have two four six I have nine piercings at the moment I just currently took out my nose ring because I put a nose ring in and I had an allergic reaction to it and my skin is just super sensitive and I can't wear anything that's fake so I don't know why I even thought I could put in a fake nose ring but it broke my whole face out like in hives so I just took it out because I was fed up and then I have my ears I have two cartilage on this side one on this side double piercings and then I have my tragus I also have my belly button I used to have my nose and I used to have a piercing underneath my tongue like right there but um, I took that one out as well because it was too little it was like an eyebrow ring and it would fall out too much and it was so hard to put the little ball maybe I'll get that again if I do it's gonna have to be like a bigger piercing probably like a belly button ring or something like that I don't think I want any more piercings the only other piercings that I would get would be either my nose again, under my tongue again, or my nips. I kind of want my nips pierced. Um, but we'll see. <laughs> Next question. Why did I start YouTube? Okay, so fun fact. <laughs> I actually had a YouTube when I was in high school. I was, well actually I started it in middle school into high school so it was like 7th or 8th grade into ninth grade and then I stopped it because I don't know YouTube wasn't really like a thing 
and I wasn't good at it at all like I was not tech savvy and I don't know I just I was more embarrassed then like if nobody really did YouTube and I didn't like the fact that people were like seeing and finding out about my channel when I was in high school because you know high school so different like everybody's so judgy it's so different compared to college like nobody cares in college you do what you want in college so that's why I'm starting it up again and hopefully I will you know do great things on YouTube the reason why I really want to start though is to really like help people because I like giving advice and I just want to give people advice and help out as much as I can. Um, maybe people want to come to FAU, so I let them know about FAU. Maybe people want to know stuff about cheer or just anything that I could help with. I'll do tons of videos. I don't want to be set to like, oh, a makeup channel or oh, a fashion channel or just like one thing. Like, yeah, I do makeup, but like I'm not just trying to base this channel off strictly makeup videos or strictly fashion videos or just not trying to be like strict about it I'll do any types of videos vlogs story times all that y'all should let me know what you want to see down below in the comments you know let me know current relationship status I am single. I plan to stay single. F another fun fact about me, I've only ever had two boyfriends in my life, but like only one serious boyfriend in my life. So I don't know. It doesn't seem like dating's the type of thing for me, but yeah my current relationship status is single and then leading on with that question it says three turn ons and three turn offs three turn ons for me would be like someone who smells good that's an instant turn on for me I love when people smell good and then you can just I don't know I just find that really attractive I like somebody who takes care of themselves like is not dirty for example like nails like if you have dirty nails I'm gonna be like you're not clean like that's nasty like <laughs> fix it taking care of yourself that that's like an all-around thing like being cleanly like working out taking care of your body a third turn on for me would be someone who is like honest and is not afraid to communicate because like I know a lot of guys and this generation now don't know how to speak to anybody and I'm a big communicator like if I have an issue I'm gonna let you know if there's a problem like I want you to let me know we can talk about it you know I'm a big vocal person I like to talk and I don't like awkwardness like I'm not shy whatsoever so I just like somebody who can talk and just good communication skills. Three turn offs would be if your breath stinks. I'm sorry, but like that's a turn off. I feel like anybody, it's disrespectful to like come and talk in my face knowing that your breath smells. Cause I know you know your breath smells. You know. Another turn off would be somebody who is extremely cocky and I get a lot of attention from cocky guys like guys who think that they're too good and like popular you know they just think that their poop doesn't stink and I just I don't like that like somebody who's just so overpowering and like just think that they can do whatever they want because you can't I don't care how cute you are I don't care how many tackles you can make I don't care how how good you are in basketball or football 
I, I don't care if you're in a frat, okay? I, it, that, that doesn't excite me. So, I hate when guys just think they can do what they want because of something like that. Another turn off, this the last one, would have to be someone who lies a lot. I'm a very honest person. Like, I'm an open book as well. So, I feel like it's so dumb to lie because the truth comes out eventually. And it's just stupid to lie. Okay, so my favorite song, I, like I said, I love music so much. Um, I have a lot of songs that I really love, but one song in particular that never seems to get old to me is Miss It by Young Blue. Go listen to it. It's a bop. <laughs> and then it says favorite rapper. So, like I said, I like a lot of music. I think my top favorites are like Kodak. I love me some Kodak. Went to his concert, would go again. Um, Young Thug's pretty good, I like his music. I like Little Baby, I like, I like a lot of people, okay? There's there's some missing. As do I like to watch sports, so I'm thinking it's like football and basketball. Yes, I like to watch sports, mainly football and basketball. I don't really watch soccer that much, but like I would. I don't really watch hockey that much, but I would. I don't know, I like sports, but my favorite sport is obviously cheerleading. I love to watch competitions and stuff like that, so yes, I like sports. Yes, I like to watch sports. My favorite place, I really love Miami, Florida. I am in love with South Florida, always have been always will be have a lot of family there I have family here in Boca Raton and I don't know my favorite place is probably Miami favorite food that's a hard question because I love food period favorite movie there's a lot of what's your favorite questions but my favorite movie would have to be like anything Disney and I really like the movie Freedom Riders. I don't know if you guys have seen that, but it's a really good movie and I highly recommend it. Oh, my zodiac sign. This is something that is interesting about me. I have two zodiac signs because I am on the cusp. If you are somebody who is into zodiac and stuff like that, you would know what the cusp means. That means like, that's when one starts, one ends, and I happen to be on that. My birthday is September 23rd of 2000, and I am a Libra and a Virgo. So, best of both worlds. What is your nationality? I get this asked all the time. I am mixed. So, the easiest way to explain me being mixed is that I am black and white that's the simplest way to put it um, my mom is white and my dad is black and that's how you get this little Oreo right here oh my favorite color is pink um, it's my favorite color in the whole wide world my whole room is pink here my whole room back home is pink as well I love the color pink and it's been like that for the longest time what am I majoring in? I am a biology pre-med major. I plan on being a doctor. I got a lot of years of school left. And I want to be an orthodontist, but I also want to be somebody who like does ultrasounds, anything like heart, babies, I want to do something like that, but I know for a fact that I want to be in the medical field. I want to be a doctor. I'm trying to make this bank. I'm trying to make this bread. We're going to accomplish this. I will make good money when I am out of school. That is the plan. 
how long have you been cheering? I have been cheering since middle school. And where I'm from, middle school starts in seventh grade. So that's when I first started cheering, was my seventh grade year. I am now a freshman in college, so it has been seven years since I have been cheering. I have also done three years of all-star cheerleading, and I loved every second of it. I love competitions, I love competing, I love performing. Have you done any sports besides cheerleading? I did dance for the longest. I danced before I cheered. I also did a year of soccer. Wasn't very good, I was kind of chubby at the time. Also, my freshman year of high school, I did track. Oh, I played flag football freshman through junior year and I stopped senior year because I was on three teams for cheerleading. Did dance my senior year and like the spring show or whatever. I also got asked um, if I have any pets. The answer is yes, I have three dogs, two Australian Shepherds and a pit bull. And then I also have a McCall parrot. Her name is Sarbers. My pit bull's name is Luna. My two Australian Shepherds, they are brother and sister and their names are Crystal and Cisco. I used to have a leopard gecko. I also used to have an iguana that I actually caught in Miami. Um, I have a fish right now, his name's Fuego. I've had birds, lots of birds. I've pretty much had a lot of animals growing up, but right now I just have my three dogs, my parrot and my fish. <laughs> Well, that's all the questions that I got. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And if you guys have any more questions or any video requests, you can put them in the comments below. I'll make sure to read them and do my best to answer all your guys' questions and do my best to make all of your guys' videos that you wanna see. I had fun making this video and I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching and have a blessed.